Yo guys, it's Adam. Welcome to Actual and today I'm here with a brand new video. So I'm extremely sorry for the lack of video guys. I know I haven't posted for like a month or so. I'm very sorry. So basically I tried to upload a video the other week. It was a World Cup match highlight of Argentina versus Iceland. Unfortunately the video got blocked by FIFA. The next day I uploaded that video, it got blocked by FIFA, so I'm very gutted about that. So I, I had no ideas of what to post on my YouTube channel, but at last I found an idea, which is what's in my football bag video. I tried to browse loads of stuff, and I found that I should do what's in my football bag video, as I'm going to England soon. So you know, I'll be playing a lot of football there, so this is what's in my football bag video, summer edition. So guys, the first item that we... that everyone needs is obviously a bag a bag to keep all of your items in there all of your football boots all of your gear in there this is a ordinary blue under armor bag i think this does the job well it has cool compartments in the side where you can put your football boots in it's big enough to put your football boots in or anything else you would like to On the other side, it also has another compartment where you can also put your boot in. This is the inside of the bag. So guys, this is not a really big bag, but I think this does the job well. and. It would do a job for you if you would like to pack all your gear in here it would do a job like it work even though it's not that big but it do a job for you guys guys next is the most essential thing that you would need to play football obviously football boots so these are my new football boots that i just got the other day they're the heritage 1998 remakes that ronaldo um the brazilian ronaldo wore, wore. these are very nice um it's a new, it's it's a Nike ID boot, which was on for a bit online, so I had to grab them up. I had to cop them, because these are, these look very nice indeed. They, Nike already released something that is a remake like this before, but I don't think it's as good, or as near, as good as this. This is an amazing boot. So guys, usually when I pack my football boots, I usually pack two, in case, in case of any injuries. In case of any injuries, in case you, in case that your new football boots, such as mine, um, in case you get blisters, you can have a spare boot so that any injuries will be prevented. So I bang in another boot of mine. These are the Predator remakes that David Beckham wore and Zinedine Zidane wore um, a long time ago. So they remade this earlier this year in October 2017. So these are very nice. I think this is kangaroo leather if I'm not wrong. Next up, guys, is socks. It is essential for football. So usually when I'm just training or like a friendly match, I just use these socks. They're very nice. They're Climacool Tango socks that Adidas released. They're very comfortable socks. So if I don't want, if I really want to be comfortable with my socks, these are the socks that I really recommend for you. It's extremely comfortable. It's very soft and it does a great job for you. But when it's a uh, competitive match, I usually cut my socks. So these are one of my socks that I cut. I cut these Ari socks. Ari is a shop in Thailand where they sell you football gear. It's 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 like Nike Town, but in Thailand. It's, it's probably the biggest shop in Thailand that sells you football boots and gear. So these Ari socks, I cut it. I cut the part. I cut like this part of it. So then I could use my Nike grip stock, Nike grip socks instead, as it has better, as it has better um, grip in it. <laughs> so these are very nice. And if you really want to be comfortable, I really recommend this over the true socks, as I've tried the true socks before, which is a, another type of grip socks. But I feel like these are probably the most comfortable ones, as the other ones, it feels a bit uncomfortable a bit on my foot. So I really don't recommend that one that much. I really recommend these. These, you, you would really like these guys. Next are my shin pads, guys. These are the Adidas, if I'm not wrong, it's the Adidas Ghost shin pads. I've had this for almost a year now, if I, I believe. 
Well, I I lost my favorite shin pads in Phuket. I had a football tournament there, and I lost it. It was very, very good. It was like a light shin pad, but it was seasick agility, so I have to use this one instead, which is still good, but it doesn't do as good as a job as the other one, but this is still good, as it's very light, but it's very, like, solid, and if in any impacts goes in, it will do a good job for you, and it will protect your... It will protect you from any injuries. It's very good. I really like these. So guys, I know this is summer edition, but in case it gets a bit, you know, cold. So I bring in some track suits, so some long sleeve shirts. These are one of my favorite. They're the they're the Nike Aero Swift shirt. So I really enjoy these. They're very good. And if it's a bit cold, they will really prevent you from the coldness. These are the, I think this is the kit version. The adult version has like a, a place where you could put your thumb in, if, I believe. So yeah, in case it gets a bit cold, which I'm going to England soon. So I believe it, it won't be that cold, but in case it gets a bit cold, I will bring these Arrow Swift tracks. So guys, now we're moving on to the kit. This is my favorite kit that I usually wear a lot in training. This is an Arrow Swift shirt, very nice shirt. I've had this for about almost a year now, I think. I bought this from Nike Town in London. It's very nice. It's a breathable shirt, as you can see here. This is the back of it. Very nice design, too. I really like these. Guys, I know it's a bit outrageous, but I really like Arrow Swift. So, my shorts are also Arrow Swift collection. They're these orange black shorts. They're very nice. This is the front, this is the back. They're very like sling. I don't know. I don't know how to say, but it's very comfortable here. So, yeah. Guys, for me, this is extremely necessary. This is your own very own water bottle. This this is an O2 cool water bottle, which means that if you store water in here, you can spray it. And then you hydrate it. Your face hydrates it. It's like a face spray. It's very nice and neat. It's sick and nice. Insulated water bottle. So, yeah, guys, this is absolutely necessary. So, guys, the next item that I think would be extremely handy to have is, is some slides. These Nike slides are really handy for me, as after any training sessions or any matches, I would I would usually wear these, as my foot would get a bit un uncomfortable after wearing these, after wearing the football boots for a long period of time. I, I like to rest my foot wearing these slides instead, so I think this would be very handy and very good for you guys to have. The next item that I think would also be very handy to have is this string bag. As you do not want to have a dirty pair of boots in your bag, would you? So I would recommend you to have a string bag to put your dirty football boots that are very smelly in here so that it would keep, it would keep your bag clean from any dirt from your football boots. The next item that I think would be very good to have is these, Perskin Doll Spray. In case of any muscle soreness or any little injuries, you could just spray this on your body. In case of any injuries, guys. So, this is very handy to have and I really would recommend you to have this in case of any little injuries or muscle soreness. So guys, after everything that I've shown you, those are the must-haves or the optional that you should put in your football bag guys that was what's in my football bag so now let's pack all of those items up in this duffel bag so firstly the towel Football boots into the string bag. Water bottle. Slippers. T-shirt, comp 
compression shorts. Socks and shin pads. And finally, a spare football boot. Oh yeah, I forgot to show you guys this compartment. This is another compartment where you can put your football boots into. So guys, now that we're all packed and ready, let's go play some football. Bye, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.